it's Jenna with Grossband Greenhouse Structures. We've been getting a lot of questions recently about greenhouse cladding, especially polycarbonate. Polycarbonate is an excellent cladding option that gives growers in any climate a sufficient way to cover their structure. We use polycarbonate to cover our state-of-the-art S2000 greenhouse as well as for the side walls on our S1000 greenhouse. While polycarbonate is featured on many greenhouses, a lot of growers may not know what this material actually is. So, what are polycarbonate sheets? Well, polycarbonate is a very strong and resilient thermoplastic material. It's also a very lightweight and durable plastic with excellent UV resistant properties that's capable of withstanding extreme temperatures, either hot or cold. Its high impact resistance properties and strength make it an ideal material for greenhouses. With all these qualities, you may be wondering, how long does polycarbonate last on a greenhouse? Well, it lasts about 10 years. Though it is durable, polycarbonate should be treated with UV protectant to prevent it from turning yellow or breaking down. With proper care, polycarbonate should have no problem lasting around 10 years. It's resistant to extreme temperatures, both hot and cold. It also resists all types of weather like sunlight, snow, rain, and impact. This allows polycarbonate to last years without fading or discoloring while also remaining damage free from any various impacts that it might encounter. The UV light degraded that piece over about 10 years and it turned yellow and brittle. If you follow the manufacturer's instructions and install it right side up, the polycarbonate panels can last up to 10 years with full sun exposure in the Midwest. Of course, where the UV exposure is greater, you may need to scale your polycarbonate lifespan accordingly. There are many options for polycarbonate that growers can choose from, but we'll cover the two primary types, single layer and twin wall. Grossband single layer panels are corrugated, so they have a box-like shape with peaks and valleys built into their design. Single layer polycarbonate has a similar clarity to glass and it can offer up to 90% light transmission. It's just a more durable and lightweight material. Single layer is a great option for greenhouse growers who don't have to worry as much about the cold temperatures. As the other choice, twin wall polycarbonate has a unique design with gaps between its layers. These gaps trap air and help retain heat inside of the greenhouse, making twin wall panels a great cladding option for growers located in colder climates. The thicker material also acts as a natural ultraviolet filter that works to shield crops inside of a greenhouse from harmful radiation. When it comes to greenhouse cladding, growers should also be thinking about their structure's insulation. A greenhouse's ability to retain heat is measured by a factor called R-value. Particularly with twin wall panels, polycarbonate has a higher R-value than most other claddings, so it's better at maintaining temperatures inside of a greenhouse. Grossman's 8 millimeter thick polycarbonate provides high quality insulation with an R-value of 1.72, in large part thanks to the air that it traps between its two layers. Since polycarbonate creates a more consistent temperature in the greenhouse, crops grow at a similar pace and achieve similar quality. Polycarbonate can also help make a greenhouse more energy efficient, so growers put less strain on their heating systems and can save on monthly utility costs. Overall, polycarbonate offers an excellent cladding for greenhouses in any region and is a facilitator for better crop growth. 